Alrighty, thanks again for the fill, ladies and gentlemen. We're doing one box of 2010 World Cup uh, soccer by Panini. This is the FIFA South Africa World Cup 2010. Uh, this is the one with the metalized cards that everybody wants. Uh, Ronaldo and Messi both in there. They're metalized cards, so for big bucks. Lots of nice rookies like Aguero, Ozil, uh, who else? Balotelli, you know who, Sanchez. Um, Ozil. Anyway, a bunch of decent guys in this as well. So let's get going. Uh, this is uh, 12 spots. Each spot gets three packs. I am Soccer Breakers FC. If you're interested in joining my breaks, join our Facebook group, Soccer Breakers FC. All breaks are live on YouTube. Check us out on our website, guys, www.soccerbreakersfc.com. Follow us on Instagram, Soccer Breakers. All right, first thing we're going to do is we're going to open this box. And we're going to make... Uh, 12 stacks of three. Hopefully, if we get 36 packs, we've been shorted a few times and only getting 35 packs, but hopefully that will not be the case. Hey, JD. Oh, just a quick note for tonight. Uh, I was able to get uh, a couple of loose boxes of uh, Impeccable. So I do finally have a few loose boxes. They just came in from uh, Blowout. So if we want to do uh, a couple of loose box breaks, like the serial number ones we were doing, uh, we will a little later tonight. I'm thinking it's probably going to be about 135 a spot. I think 134, 135, something like that. I got to price it, but. Yeah, just one spot by serial number. That's how we've been doing it. I mean, one box. Uh, alrighty, so let's bring up the randomizer. There it is. Okay, we're going to roll the dice. We re-roll snake eyes. Otherwise, we go with it. We don't do snake eyes seven times. We'll go seven times. All right, we got Tom Bernard on top. We got Andy on the bottom. And we're going to go seven times. This will determine who gets which stack. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven. There we go. Rilan on top and Brad on the bottom. So now let me get rid of no, that one we need. Let's get rid of this one. Let's get rid of that one. Let's add this one. All right, there we go. All right, we're good to go. Stack one is Rilan. Good luck, Rilan. New Zealand, and we got 
Cuatemo Blanco. Yeah, I'm excited. Is he sound like he's definitely in the lineup tomorrow? Is that what the word is? Be nice to see a healthy team. Eto. Between him and uh, you know, if you get Pulisic, get you know Chilwell in there at the same time. I mean, I'd like to see like their best team for once, and see how they uh, how they look. There's Henri, Kerhin, Tulalan. Sorry, Rilan, nothing too sexy there. You got a Blanco. Uh, That was Rilan Murakami. Thank you, Rilan. Ooh, I forgot your... Sorry, I forgot one card there. Jason Crittell, Jason Crittell, stack two. Good luck, Jason. Uruguay, Marek Hansik. Alexa, what time does Chelsea play? Chelsea and Southampton will face off tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. in the English Premier League. Did that answer your question? Yes. Thanks for your feedback. There's U.S. There's the boy, Mr. You-Know-Who Sanchez. And Jason, your last pack. Slovenia and Stankovic. All right, those were Jason's packs. To get the first year, you know who. I will choose above what's clear. I will choose free will. Do, 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 do. Jason Crittell. Number 38. Begin the day with a friendly voice and companion unobtrusive. Curtis Snow. Plays that song that's so elusive and the magic music makes your morning mood. Ennis, what's up, buddy? Harry. This is Curtis Snell. Number three. Alexa, what is the EPL schedule for tomorrow? Everton and Liverpool will face off tomorrow morning at 4.30 a.m. in the English Premier League. Chelsea and Southampton will face off tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. in the English Premier League. Man City and Arsenal will face off tomorrow morning at 9.30 a.m. in the English Premier League. 
Newcastle United and Manchester United will face off tomorrow afternoon at 12 p.m. in the English Premier League. Oh, that's well. Mm, there you go. Uh, last pack for Curtis. Good luck, Curtis. Ivory Coast, Wayne Rooney. Yeah, that Liverpool uh, Everton's a uh, huge. My betting account has gone down the tubes the last few weeks, so I need to have a good day, make a little comeback. Tinky tips, I know, man. I need some tinky tips. Uh, Curtis Snow. All right, Curtis, that was you. Ian Moriarty, Ian Moriarty, one spot, lots of one spotters. Ian Moriarty. Ghana, Gurkhoff. What a pie pool. Oh, awesome. Nathan, okay, which team is he on? Nathan, okay. What is he, I know he plays in the EPL, but. All right, this is for Ian. Okay. Greece, Alexander Song, he's on the Netherlands, so okay. Last pack for Ian. North Korea and David Silva. All right, so that was Ian. Sal Murillo. Sal Murillo. Pack, pack five. Sal, good luck. Paraguay. Honda. Sung Young. Steve Gerard Gerard la -dee -da, -dee da 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 Yep, I posted a bunch more uh, euro in the site, guys. Um, prices were dropped on every team, some more than others. Nice, Balotelli and Pirlo. So. We have one that has only two teams left, I think. And then we have some that have, like, anyway, around 10 teams left still. Um, again, all teams were reduced.
All right, so five. That goes to Saul. We have to. Chelsea's going to win the Premier League. That's easy. No problem. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't think Chelsea. But I'd love to see someone other than Liverpool or Man City win. Let's put it that way. I'd love to see Everton win it. That would be refreshing. As long as Chelsea finishes in the top four. Uh, some. Thoughts on Jose. Jose Mourinho or Jose? Six. Uh, Andy Neo. Andy Neo. Good luck, Andy. Yeah, Luke, there's still a lot of. Uh, oh, boy. Oh, boy. Andy's back. Andy is back. My tip and. No! Also, that just looks a little funky there. Is that how it's supposed to? I guess that's just how the design is. I think that's just the design. That little there looks almost like a... Well, I guess that's just the way the design is. I don't know. It looked like it was a little ding, but I think it's just the design. It's just a kind of blotches all over the place. So. There you go, Andy. Andy is back. Andy's one of the OG breakers, one of the original gangsters. He's been around a while. Yeah, you see, that one just looks a little too silvery. I don't know. That one kind of stood out. There you go, Andy. Congrats, buddy. Can't tell. I can't tell if that's normal or not normal. I just don't remember that being that silver. Still pretty sick, no matter what it is. All right, you still got two more chances at doing the double deed. See if you can do the double deed. And there's Serbia, Sully Montari. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Andy. Happy birthday to you. And Chibe and Barry. There you go, Andy. Nice one there. Let's slip through a little top loader so Ronaldo gets a little protection. Yeah, I'm telling you, in my opinion, the 2010 is the best value out there. Just because, you know, I mean, 2006 sells better, but if you just kind of compare price and how easy it is to get a 9 or a 10, I think this is the better deal. There you go, Andy. So that one's... Ronaldo action there for Andy. All right, halfway through, Tom Bernard. Good luck, Tom. All right. My boy, Frankie. Are you and Yakinta? Yeah, you can, but actually, in you can get tens. I mean, I've had some people get tens um, in this one. It's it's much harder to get nines and tens in the other one. But in this one, you should get a nine. I mean, if it looks good to the eye, you should get a nine or a ten. 
But the other one, sometimes it looks good and you get like an 8 or a 7. Which is, I don't know why, but I guess they're seeing something that we're not seeing. Buffon. But I know Robert got a 10. He turned his in. Did you get yours back, all of yours, all four of them, uh, Tinky, or no? You had four, I think, right? Three or four. There's Drogba. Were they all nines, no tens? I right, got Buffon and Drogba. Three of you. I'd, I mean, if I had to guess, I because I remember those. Those look pretty good. I, I'm hoping you'll get at least two or three tens out of that and the rest nines. So if you can get three tens and three nines, that would be pretty awesome. But... Um, That was Tom Bernard. Yeah, because as I recall, I remember checking yours out before I sent them out, and they did look pretty good, at least to me. Eight, uh, Stephen Skiba. Good luck, Stephen. Stephen Skiba. Back eight. Carlos Vela and David Villa. It's Vela's first World Cup. Yeah, PSA 10, I would think you'd get at least three. I mean, they were selling for a lot, but they've, you know, I think they were a little overpriced at 6800 when the last one sold. But I'd say about three for the tens and maybe a thousand for the nines. England. Nani, I think if you can get the 10 in the 2006, then that should be worth six, seven grand easy. But that's in the 2006, the 2010. Mexico and Hitzelsperger. Right, so that was for Steven Skiba. Sorry, Steven, nothing too sexy there. I have a ton of 2014 out. I have about 300 plus cards getting graded right now for just base cards, though. Mostly Messi, Ronaldo, and Neymar base cards from 2014. And then I have a bunch of Ronaldo and Kevin De Bruyne from Euro 16 out. This is, uh, who is this? Number eight was Steven Skiba. Uh, I will look, Tinky. I, I have quite a few messy autos, actually. If you have a particular product in mind, let me know. Uh, nine, Jacob Watlington. I have uh, quite a few of them. Depends on your price range. Are you looking to refinance your house, or are you just looking to like take a little small credit card loan out? <laughs> Vela and Yakin. That's number nine. So that is Jacob Watlington for the stack. Jacob. Okay, all right, let me see what I can find something for you. I know I have a bunch. Um, I have on card. I have not on card. Like, what was the one that had a bunch of on cards? I think it was gold standard, right? The the Barca gold standard ones. That's sure. 
and that's under 2K. I have some really nice eminence ones, but those I'm holding for the mother of all soccer breaks. Those are going for more right now. Brazil and Canoe. And then last one for Jacob. Good luck. Come on, Jacob. Yeah, it's gonna be a, I think it's going to be the ball. Australia, and you got the Jabulani ball. Oh, there's plenty of Messi autos that I have for, for under 2K. I mean, I think there's Messi autos even around 1,000, right? Like some of the sticker autos, I think, go for around, the, I think they started about 1,000. At least they used to a couple weeks ago or a month ago. I don't I haven't checked to see if they've gone up or not. Uh, Harry, it depends. What is what's next? Is one twenty next, or is it like is one? I forget what number we're on. If it's next, it should definitely go tonight. If it's not next, uh, it's uh, if it's like the second one, then maybe. Um, but anything like I plan to do at least one chronicles, maybe two. So it just depends on uh, where it's at. Uh, Jacob Watlington. All right, that was Jacob. Thank you, Jacob. Uh, that's fine, Harry. Yeah, we'll get it full. I think that if I recall correctly, there were only like four or five teams left. Uh, so yeah, 120 should go next. I mean, not next, but should go tonight. Yeah, it, it won't go next, but it will go tonight. Um, France Thimo. France Thimo. Stack 10. Good luck, France. Impeccable school. All right, we'll do that one too. Vanderville and Tevez. Italia. Maicon and France, you got one more pack. Good luck. France, Timo. Come on, one time for France. Honduras and Poulsen. Sorry, France, you got a Tevez. That was nice, but not much else. Hey, Greg, what's going on, buddy? France. There you go, France. Number 11, Eric. Good luck, Eric. Let's see if Eric can get back on the winning track here. Good luck, Eric. Cameroon and Opa Katsuranis for Greece. There's a Henri. Dale Walcott. Van Bommel. Josie Altidore 
and Mikhail Balak. Sorry, Eric. Brad's our last shot at Messi. Okay, we haven't hit Kaka. We haven't hit Messi. I love you too, man. Yes, we should be doing Chronicles 120 today at some point. Gotta sell it out first, but we will. We should be able to. Um, Eric Sansala. All right, last stack, Brad Pal. Oh, we got. Didn't we have one for Brad already, or no? No, we didn't. We didn't. All right, so it was just he was in the 12th spot. He landed. And there we go. Uh, yes. In fact, uh, I was planning on doing uh, 260 right after this one. There's that. Uh, Miroslav Klose. Uh, the 2018 Fat Packs one is coming up right after this. That was also sold out before I got on. Get those two out of the way. España. There's the dive master himself, Mr. Aryan Robin. Um, Messi and Ronaldo. Those are the two best cards to hit out of this. France and Yaya Torre. Sorry, guys. Just uh, one Ronaldo. No Messi this time out of this box. We got one Ronaldo and no Messi's. All right, so that was Brad's stack. All right, we're going to get right into the fat packs. That should be fast. What's up, Tom, brother? Sorry, I just saw a text came through. Oh, you're welcome, brother. You're welcome, man. Glad you got it. Uh, Brad Pallant. That does it for number 38. Let me end 